going to test the 450 bush mister today with uh, a couple of different types of ammo. We'll be shooting it out of the Ruger American in the 450 Bushmaster, completely stock. And I've got one round in the magazine of the Hornady Black Ammo. That's a 250 grain uh, bullet. And the velocity is 2200 feet per second. And uh, the brand new ARX 450 Bushmaster Ammo with the uh, Inceptor bullet. That's a 158 grain frangible bullet and it's uh, advertised at 2620 feet per second. So we're going to take a couple shots into through the chronograph and into a, uh, a, a shoulder bone off a white-tailed deer and into wet uh, some wet catalogs and that should give us an idea of uh, penetration and how the bullets hold up. So here we go. <coughs> Okay, we wanted to see how it would react, how the uh, bullets will react going through the bone first. That's my concern with the frangible bullets. That was the Hornady Flex Tip, 250 grain. It went through three of those catalogs, and they're 2,000 pages each. I didn't have the chronograph on, but now I do. All right, we're gonna cut them open now. I'm gonna do it this way. There's the new uh, ARX Inceptor. Just made it, punched a clean hole right through that bone. Whereas the Hornady uh, broke it apart a little bit. First we're going to look at we're going to look at the inceptor. It made it into the second catalog. Entrance hole. 
it came through there. It did not come out. There it is. What's left of it? Very little. So definitely one tiny little fragment there. That's all I could find. So it definitely came apart. Now we're going to look at the Hornady. So that made it through uh, I can feel some particles, that's about it. Then it made it through I don't know, probably 2,200 pages. Nothing in this one. Now, we're going back to the Hornady. And it went through, uh, it went completely through two catalogs. Again, there's the first one. There's the second one. Out. And this is the third one, right there. There it is. Beautiful. I'm not gonna be able to weigh, weigh this bullet, but as you can see, The jacket is still there, mushroomed out beautifully, and pretty much intact. As far as I'm concerned, it's a much more desirable effect for a, a big game bullet.